I'll get you as close as I can to the Golden Cat, Corvo. You'll have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holga Square. The main thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat, if he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Be careful going up the street, Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering now. I guess you getting rid of Campbell shook up the Lord Regent. Citizens, Thaddeus Campbell, formerly High Overseer. No longer a citizen of Dunwall. Hey, you're just the man I was looking for. Slackjaw's wanting to talk to you. Is that him? Yeah, he's the one. Hey, we got a message for you from. Go on. Slackjaw's inside. My men were right. You do look like a man out for murder. Way I figure it, there ain't nobody worth killing round here except those two Pendletons over at the Golden Cat. I'm right, ain't I? See, slack your nose. Them boys are twins. Rich, mean, and weird. Worse than most of their ilk. They've been laying low there a while, not sure why. There's a lot of security at the Golden Cat tonight, though. Special guests and the like. But you're gonna walk in there, dressed like that, and kill the Pendleton brothers? Maybe I got a better way to take care of them, too. If you're doing something for me first, understand. Someone, I don't know who, is killing my men, taking my territory, stealing my goods. Might be a fellow name of Galvani. I sent my best man to investigate, but he went missing and... Well, now I need someone to find what happened to him. Go to this Galvani's place. He lives nearby off Clavering Boulevard. You do that for me and I'll get your better way into the Golden Cat. <laughs> Smoke or eat? Blow off, chopper.
Side, all dead and bloody, and that you are a stinking idiot. Hey, 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 wait a bit. What just occurred to me? How come it's always me who pay for the whiskey? Shush up.
Why crazy? What just happened? What's this? Information from my missing guy. Let's have a listen. Blackjaw, it's me, Crowley. I'm making this in case I don't make it back. He was right. There is someone once you did. Wants to take over the distillery and the whole Bottle Street gang. And you'll never believe who it is, neither. At first, I did. That's why it's taken me so long. I wanted to be sure, and... What's that? Ah! No! No! Ah! So Crowley's dead. Too bad. He was one of my best men. Still, you and me had a deal, and Slackjaw never goes back on a deal. Take this key. It ain't for the golden cat, no. This key's for the captain's chair. A hotel abandoned since the plague gutted this part of town. Take the stairs to the top. You can use the roof to get into the golden cat brother. See that? Slackjaw keeps a bargain. Just as good as the men who run the city. Maybe a little better. You think about that. Now maybe we can help each other out again. I could get rid of the Pendletons for you, quiet-like and without killing them. But you gotta do something for me in return. The Cat's having a big reopening tonight. Lot of money clients. Including an arts dealer named of Bunting. He's got particular tastes, or so I've been told by some of the ladies. Got some pretty fancy stuff locked away at his place. And the only thing preventing me from nabbing all that loot is the combination to a safe. Of course, the Pendletons have been camped out there for months too, not sure why. So that means a lot of the City Watch and other soldier types. Bring me that combination, my masked friend, and then I take care of the Pendleton brothers. Just like that. You ain't never even gonna touch them. And I promise. I won't kill them, and no one will ever see them again. Now, if that ain't a deal, Slackjaw don't know what is. What a mess, huh? Whole town's gone to trash. Attention Dunwall citizens, a mandatory whale oil ration is now in effect. Non-compliance is a punishable offense.
Attention, Dunwall citizens. This district is now under a mandatory whale oil ban. Compliance will be strictly enforced. Duty too. Want me to show you? <laughs> If one of them gets hurt, I'll lose my job. Oh, that's just the girls' talk. Oh, yeah. It's Jesus. nothing. Jesus. Pressure builds up in the pipes and... That almost never happens. I'll make sure they never mention it again. Anyhow, Morgan insisted to be in the steam room tonight. He's so... Yeah, dies. Custom. Sneak around, aren't you? They, they, they told me you were head chopped off and in, in the prison, dead, like, like mother. That seems like a long time ago. But you're not dead. Now we can leave. I have a plan. I almost got away twice. There's a special door to come and go for special people, and I'll show you. And if anyone tries to stop us, you can fight them. It's this way.
that nice girl again. The one I told you about. You realize you're at the Golden Cat. Dunstan, the Pendleton's She's different. You're supposed to be on duty. Right? Come on. You're supposed to be on guard. Idiot. She likes your money, not you. You're just jealous. Shut up. been like this for 20 minutes. Your footsteps sound a little loud. Have you gained a little weight, Bunny? Now, just like last time, understand? Slowly, and only trigger the shock at my command. Get it? And the safe word tonight will be retribution, let's say. You hear that, you stop. One shock out of line, and you are out of a job. Oh, oh, oh that's good. I deserve that one. Shall I tell you why? The Pendletons are here, right? I'll start with them. I've cheated them, robbed them of thousands. Oh, you're ruthless. Don't hold back. I'll tell you everything. The Pendleton's inheritance was worth hundreds of thousands at least. I told them it was junk. Oh, ah, retribution! Retribution! Oh, that was perfect. But it's all I can take for tonight. Call my servants. We're done. Ah! We're done, I said. Retribution! Now let me out! Ah! What the... Who is this? What do you want? The safe. Yes, of course. The combination is 138. Take anything you find. I think I felt my heart skip. Locked. Prudence, the old hag. She caught me trying to get away. Now she keeps the key with her. We've got to find the key to the Did you hear what that little girl did? Yeah, no. Nice. She's cute. Amy or Emily or something. She tried to escape. Somehow she found the VIP exit. Really? Yes, Prudence keeps it locked with all the the only key. Why is she here anyway? Is she some niece of the Pendletons? No idea. They keep her hidden away.
Let's go. Let's get out of here. This place is on the river. Come on. Come to dinner now. That's right. My sweet little birds. Come to grant. It's good to see you again, dear. But don't dally, or that young girl might fall in the river. Have you seen it? The handsome one with the beautiful dark You brought me the numbers. I've been after this combination for months. If you ever need steady work, you come see me. Slackjaw knows a good man when he sees one. It's only natural that you'd be curious about what I intend to do with the Pendletons. See, the Pendletons got these rock mines. Have hundreds of souls working down there half a mile deep below ground. So I'm gonna shave their heads and cut out their tongues and put them in one of their own stinking mines. Then they're gonna see life from a different angle. What a mess, huh? Whole town's gone to trash. Attention, Dunwall citizens. Thaddeus Campbell, formerly High Overseer. Are you both ready to go? Corvo, you must have worked wonders out there in the city tonight. I can't believe my old eyes. So you did the business, did you, Corvo? I'm not one to speak against my betters, mind you, but if anybody ever deserved their fate, it was those Pendletons. What business are you talking about? Oh, I, uh... 
grown-up business, girl. I mean, your ladyship. Forgive me. It's okay. I heard a lot of grown-up business at the Golden Cat. Oh. I should concentrate on piloting this boat. Young Lady Emily, I'm Callista. I'll be caring for you and schooling you while you're with us. Pleased to meet you. As am I. Would you like to see your room in the tower? Can I see it? Yes, you may. You'll get to see it all. The entirety of the Hound Pits. Good. I think I'll like it here. I'll go with Callista, Corvo. I'll see you later. You do not fail to impress. Armed with a blade, you've changed the course of the city forever. And with the Pendleton twins gone, our own Lord Pendleton will assume their votes in Parliament. In one night, you've done more than most men do in a lifetime. I need to speak to you soon. But for now, Lord Pendleton requests your attention. <laughs> 